Bye! So it's uh, the first day of your tandem ride. Um, where are you heading off from? We're heading from Lillyshaw in the West Midlands. Well, not quite in the <laughs> yeah, Shropshire, Telford area. Uh, and we're heading off down to Cheltenham. Great. Okay, so the total uh, today is uh, forty thousand nine hundred eight pounds. <laughs> oh no! It That's is amazing. It is amazing. So still, uh, just wow. under. Yeah. So we just need to raise. 20 more. Yep, so thanks for everyone who's given. So there's been more coming in over the night. Oh, that's amazing. The sky's just opened, started to rain. <laughs> and it's blowing a gale. Well, it's, no, it's not a gale, but it is blowing. Um, and there's one thing that um, on Facebook, we asked them to name your bike because your bike haven't, hasn't been named yet. So here are Don't the a girl's name. Okay, Trixie the Tandem, uh, Daisy, uh, Tallulah, Steve, The Dream Machine. Uh, which one are going to go with those? Tallulah. 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 Yeah. Okay. Tallulah. Thanks, Hilary, for that. We're going to call it Tallulah. <laughs> and uh, for the first bit, you're joined by a friend. Yeah, yeah. that's Matt. Hello. Right. <laughs> Matt knows how to ride bikes. <laughs> <laughs> and he's just going to help navigate us through to the first leg. First oh. bit. Fantastic. Yeah, great. So, see you on your journey. Yeah. Well, Thank great. you. Just be careful. Be careful when you get to the bottom. Bye! 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 Ready for a break, Jimmy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's been lovely, a lovely start. Yep. Yeah, really yeah. Morning, Matt, yeah. best bit of the journey? Best bit of the journey was seeing Jimmy and Sarah nearly knock their heads off at a canal bridge. Fantastic. Just in time. Lower than we thought. And then the next bridge, I sent my bike into the room at the time. <laughs> went, went underneath it. Um, no, it's been great. And it's been great actually having uh, Matt just lead us out because it's been. I'm uh, just stop at every junction to say where we're going, where we're going. Yep. So that's made a big difference, actually. Fantastic. So, yeah, sure. good start. Yeah, good. After the, the bad rain at the beginning, it's calmed down a bit and it's been really nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That headwind you're worried about? Um, you can feel it, but it's all right. Yeah. It's all right. Wind the times. Yeah, 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 wind behind you. Yeah, yeah. 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 good. Five yeah. yeah. it's great. The aftermath of a devastating earthquake. to education of Sabrina Sydney, starring Roy Bremner, is at 2.15. BBC News at 2 o'clock. In the last few moments, two the new French president... And on arrive outside Hanbury Village Hall. No sign of Jimmy and Sarah, no sign of the church but um, hopefully I'll find them. Roughly, they are um, not very far away. You should reach your destination by 1409. Right. Hanbury Church. This could be it. Church only. Let's try that route. There we go. Oh, and outside, as if by magic, there's a Jimmy. Hello, the first St. Stephen's, eh? Have you been here long? And actually, our St. Stephen's. But you know what? They're doing a heating scheme as well. Are they? Yeah, they're we? raising money for heating because their church is also very cold. Isn't that funny? So you're hungry? Yep. Hard work, blowing, strong wind. Up and down. A big steep hill just up to the church. The church is on top of a hill. Mind you, our St. Stephen's is on the hill. I don't think our St. Stephen's is the church on the hill. Yep. And this St. Stephen's is on a hill. Different different views. Different really. views, <laughs> yep. Although, although in the distance, we can see Oak Claymore. 
egg. Egg. It egged. Getting an egg. It's, so, uh, it, was about, it was about to egg. Yeah. The tire, in technical terms, the tire wall was beginning to give. Um, it's an old tire. Yeah. But it would. My fear was that that would have gone through, and I mean that you would have egged out. Yeah. And, and burst. And burst. And so, new tire on the bike. New tire. There you go. Ooh, lovely and clean. Nice clean tire. Final leg of day one. Final long leg of day one. Yep. Wait. Down to Cheltenham. Yep. And who are you seeing in Cheltenham? Uh, we're seeing our friend Sue and possibly Phil. How are you feeling, leg-wise, health-wise, energy-wise? Yeah, leg. Like, yeah, good. Good. Yeah, I'm alright actually. Yeah. Yeah, better than I thought I would be. Any yeah. any sore fingers or? No, I'm all right now. It's after a half hour stop, I'm okay. Your legs went red. My legs went red, but that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Right. Look, they're fairly dirty. <laughs> there we are. Um, I Jimmy, Jimmy seems to have avoided. Yeah. Jimmy <laughs> avoids the puddles, and then the, the uh, then I go through it. <laughs> no. <laughs> but yeah, and we're still talking. So all is well. Oof. Don't worry, they're still alive. Oh, there you go. Sarah's just moved. And this next bit of the leg, well, I hope Jimmy's moved as well. Next bit of the leg is a little bit longer than the first two parts. Um, and they're already tired. And it says it should take for a normal cyclist three hours, 13 minutes. And the time is now just about three o'clock. So maybe 6.30. Maybe they'll be there just in time for tea but they're likely to be very tired. Down all these A roads, there's some very quaint little things. Look at that, thatched, oh, thatched cottage. Just entering Peopleton. Ah, you'll know where Peopleton is because it's just outside Uptown Snodsbury. Amazing names here. But hopefully I'm gonna catch up with Jimmy and Sarah. Well, they'll catch up with me uh, while I wait for them. So in Pershaw, I lost Jimmy and Sarah, they turned a direction they shouldn't have, but quite easy to locate them. It's hard work. Yeah. <laughs> it's windy this afternoon, it's hard work. Yeah. And I thought that we didn't have very long left and Jimmy's just told me we've got at least another hour and a half. Yeah, yeah. When I said three quarters of the way, I double checked and you were just over half. But now you're three quarters of the way. Is that good? You never do that again. I didn't mean to. Hey, discussing with Jimmy if we got lost or not. No, we didn't get lost. <laughs> we'll let the viewers decide that. <laughs> you took an alternative route to the planned one, but you weren't lost. Plan. Yeah. Do you think you followed the plan? Not complete. Final push, Sarah. You can do it. Well, final push for today. Yes. Yes. And Tallulah served you well. Tallulah's doing great. Yep, she is. She's doing great, but no yeah, more eggs. Maybe no more eggs. Tire's good. Good. It was a good. It was a good plan to change the tire. Yeah. And, uh, it's a couple more hours. Um, we need to get there before it's dark. <laughs> yeah. well, that's a nine o'clock. There they are. Jimmy and Sarah arriving. Oh, very good. Made up a lot of time at 6.35. Let's give him a wave. Hiya! Well done! Oh, we can see how they made up a lot of time, but Jimmy looks tired. Oh, well done, you two. Well done. Oh, my goodness. Come on in. You made it in Cheltenham. We did. Here we are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, what was the hardest part of today? Um, for me, I think it was the last six miles or so when it, they seemed to go on forever and seemed to be uphill with a big wind. And I... Yeah, the, I found the last, yeah, last little bit really hard. Jimmy, what's the hardest bit for you today? I'd probably echo that. It's certainly the last third of the day. Um, and also just the, uh, it was a constant just um, into the wind. Yeah. Which is, which is a killer on a bike. 
Yeah. Um, you know, it just sort of like it, it just adds effort, extra effort by 10, 15%. For, um, for me, and for so both of us, it's our longest ever day on the bike. Yeah. I've never done, I've never done that bike before. So you must really care about the flooring? Well, I don't think it's just about the flooring, Adam. It's, no. Um, it's, it's about, yeah, we're doing this because we we love West Bowling and we want a better building so that we can do many more things in there. Um, the floor will enable that to happen, but it's much bigger than that. Yeah. Yeah. So, guys, if you're giving, and if you have given, you've given to something much bigger than just flooring, it's changing a community. Mm, it really is. That's, that's why we're doing it. That's why we're doing it, yeah. And